So guys, do you know what you're here to do today? Canadian snacks! Yeah! I'm hoping for maple. I'm also hoping for maple. Yeah. whole new world of Canadian snacks for mm -hmm. us and you to enjoy. Are we talking like delicious Canadian snacks or are, well, we, we, are we about to get like... Uh, the Canadian durian. Blindsided, yeah, by some... Durian, eh? Have you been to Canada? I have. Have you? Yes, uh, Toronto, uh, Quebec City and Montreal. Ooh. Oh, lovely. Yeah. I've been to Toronto and I've been to Vancouver. Well, British Columbia. I went to Vancouver you, for like a day. I have a friend who is Canadian French. Mm -hmm. I have another friend who's just regular Canadian. Mm -hmm. I haven't you haven't, eaten them. You haven't yeah. cannibalized, okay. Yet. Okay. One day. Yes. I expect them to be quite salty and cheesy. Um, <laughs> That's a great snack, salty and cheesy. <laughs> oh. Paolo mine. Paolo mine. Paolo mine. Paolo mine. Paolo like mine. you. Paolo. You're a Paolo mine. This is, this is good that we're sharing. Yeah, you're a Paolo mine. You're a Paolo, Paolo mine. mine. <laughs> and you're a Paolo of ours. Fudge and peanuts. Oh. Oh, 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 sorry. Oh, oh, so you broke sorry, it already. Sorry, I, I thought you'd... Uh, okay. Oh, it's made for sharing. There's two. Ah, that's very, that's ah, very big. nice. I'd be disappointed though. I'd be like, I want a full bar. The maple leaf is on it, which makes me hope that there's some maple flavor. Oh yeah, I see that there. It's f it's five maple leaves. Five it's like, it's ma like five stars, but five <laughs> maple leaves. I love that rating system. I know, it's like if we did ratings <laughs> in the pots of gold. Yeah. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, it's real soft. Mm. Oh. I like that. Okay. I know we say it all the time, but that and a cup of tea mm. would be mm. quite the sensation. Oh my God. Oh, fuck me. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not getting any peanuts. Like, I can see there's a peanut there. It's almost marzipan like. I was afraid. Mm. Terrified. <laughs> that the dark chocolate would be too dark, but it's not too dark at all. We have these things over here called heroes, and in them there's a fudge. Mm -hmm. It's like that, but. 10 times better. I think I had half a peanut in this whole thing. Yeah, and th that's the sort of ratio of nut I like. <laughs> I'm looking for the nuts. You I know, want you nuts. You are full nut. I'm a nut fan. I would like more nuts. I do feel like though, it's miss missing something just to give it that extra. And it might be tea. It might need something like tea it to might like be tea. warm it up. Because we're Irish, we have to rate everything in terms of how good it goes with a cup of tea. Oh yeah. Great with tea. Great with tea. Great with tea. I wouldn't think of these colors, sorry, mm -hmm. like, but they actually work really, really well. It's yeah. really cool. Nostalgia, you know, 1950s. Kind of, you could see this in the fallout world. Decent start. Great Middle start. of the road. We're going all the way down to Flavor Town, Destination Canada. It's a good start? Yeah. yeah good. Very, very good start. Very good start. Strong start. Doing well, Canada. Choose. Choose. Assorted, Choose wisely. Assorted. Uh, oh, bubble gum! I've never had gum on the channel. I love gum. Oh, wow. Sour bubble gum. Oh, I love sour shit. Sorry, I, I love sour stuff. <laughs> I... It's okay. <laughs> Sorry, I know the you Canadians are so polite. I just didn't want to offend oh, them. Oh, that's so true. It's so true. When I had braces as a child, the dentist said, like, don't have bubble gum. This bitch immediately was like gum, it was straight in the mouth. I didn't care. Okay, so okay. I'm getting kind of uh, Warheads kind of vibes from this. Yeah. I haven't had bubble gum in a very long time. Do you know what? Could never master the art of bubbles. Me neither. Couldn't do it. Me neither. People could just be like popping the whole time and blowing bubbles. Mm -hmm. couldn't, couldn't do I it. could never blow a bubble to save my life. Yay! Oh, Ooh, these look like um those American ones. Oh. <laughs> these look like homemade drugs. Yeah, they do a little bit actually. Uh, can we swallow these? <laughs> no, no, because they're chewing gum. I mean, you can if you want to. God, okay. I'm not your mom. <laughs> oh my God, they're hard. Oh, they're really hard. Okay, this is the hard kind of oh, bubble gum. This is not bubble gum, this is like rocks. Yeah. Very tiny piece of gum. So what I would do, I'd probably put the whole thing in my mouth. Chew it up and then it'll be like a normal size. You're not supposed to take more than one at a time. You're not supposed to. That's very clear now. <laughs> I wish they had put that on the packet. <laughs> oh no. It's like kneading bread dough. It's not very much. to keep going until it's mm -hmm. all one, one to last piece. If you didn't tell me this was bubblegum, I'd swallow it. Mm. These would last. I don't think these would go off. I would say sour is a lie. Whoa. Mm. Real sour. Good, nice, sharp sting of sour. Mm. Mm. It takes a while to chew it into a shape that you recognize as like as chewing gum. Here's the homogeneous mass I'm just gonna chew on for a while. Yeah. We're just gonna sit here for the next 10 minutes, Colin, while we see how long the flavor lasts. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. Chew fast. <laughs> just like a 10 hour super cut. <laughs> 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 on loop. Like you were saying about like when you were a kid, you got braces and you're told you couldn't have chewing gum. 
Mm-hmm. You then is the target market for this. Mm-hmm. Like a little kid loves I'm this. wearing dungarees. Boy, had it. I do, <laughs> I do love gum. <laughs> I would rather swallow. So oh. the fact that I'm going to have to spit this. That's fair. It's been more effort. Swallowing is more convenient. Mm-hmm. Nice little mess. Yep. You don't have to get up over it anywhere. If Chews yeah. had a had a version that you could swallow, I'd Agreed. choose them over a Palomine. I agree. Yeah. But as it stands, Palomine. Palomine's a winner. Oh, we Whoa. got one each. Oh, wow. Whoa, it's in a box. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, hey. Cherry oh, blossom. This cherry blossom. Looks so good. Oh my god. My favorite kind of cherry would be like a glass A cherry. Mm-hmm. But like cherries on their own, I'm not huge into. Yeah, they can be very sour. Uh, Unless it's a black cherry. The size of this thing. This looks like it's from the 1950s. Yeah, I admit. <laughs> this looks like it's like you're a soldier fighting in the Korean War and you have a ration pack. This is all you get. And you take out like, oh my cherry blossom, this is what keeps me warm late at night. I like how they're like individually boxed. I also like the shape of them. I feel like they're kind of like the, the, the chocolates in Matilda. Oh my God, yes. And like they'd be floating up and then she's like, <laughs> let's have a taste. Right. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh. Mm. oh, God. There's coconut in this. Yeah, I just got that there. I love coconut. This keeps going. This is, yeah. I didn't have high hopes for that. That's, mm. that's good. Oh, no, no, no. I have to hold it like this because all my juice is flowing out. Is that just a cherry? Mm-hmm. Oh! Mm-hmm. This that's is, a good cherry. This is really good. I don't know if you can like even see it, but it's like, I know. I know how this sends, but it is. It's milky at the top, then you got the cherry, and then like cherry juice. There's loads of peanuts. In the chocolate. Mm-hmm. The cherry stuff is delicious. Mm. I want to get the cherry though. Well, if you had these with like a cherry liqueur inside. I've had chocolate with cherry liqueur mm. and I hated them. This is what I expected. It's like, messy. You couldn't have this on the go. No. <clears throat> you no. couldn't be on the underground, the subway. I'm just gonna <laughs> chow down on my cherry blossom. Mm-hmm. They work really, really well together. This is really like balanced. With their powers combined, they are Captain Planet. Basically, yeah. Yeah, it is, mm-hmm. it is more than the sum of its parts. Did we go back in time? Everything except for the shoes has been very like 50s aesthetic. Um, popcorn and robe de sucre rose. Pink candy popcorn. Pink can what does that mean? Pink candy. That's very loosey goosey. What do you mean by pink candy? Popcorn is my main thing. I love popcorn. If you're like you're going to a desert island, take a snack food with you. Popcorn. Jamie, there's a prize. Oh, it's a free there's prize. There's a free prize inside. <laughs> we get it. Sorry, I was not acknowledging We it. get it. Will you shut up? I'm late on the bill. <laughs> I want it. I'm more excited. Oh. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Labels. The, the prize is fucking stickers. No. No. That's so upsetting. Let me try another one. Hold on. <laughs> I'm so disheartened. That is so upsetting. I'll be honest, that is not good. I do not like that bite. It's a little stale. Oh, I hate this. I've had different kinds of popcorns, but the important part of popcorn is the crunch. Yeah. It's not just the soft part, it's the crunch. There's no crunch in that. There's not much flavor to it. Oh my God, the popcorn is so flavorless. So flavorless. Tastes pink. Tastes like shit. (laughs) That's really bad. Is this from the 1950s? We just had something of lots of different things coming together to make it better. Yeah. Now we're having something with different things coming together and making it all worse. I like sweet popcorn a lot, mm. but I feel like the glaze on this is kind of like soaked in. and Yeah, it's too it, much. It went soggy and then it didn't go back to being crunchy. It just was like no structural integrity whatsoever. That's so upsetting. Oh, I really want <clears throat> to like this one. That's an unlucky elephant. That is an unlucky elephant. Yeah, I'd agree. Matches? No. <laughs> Trills. Thr- thrills. What a thrill. Woo! Are you are you draining my energy or something? <laughs> I have no energy and you're going off the head. <laughs> right, let's, this, this is it's good. gum! I'm sorry, I got so distracted with it still tastes like soap. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it says on the package. It still tastes like, like soap. soap. What? Something should not taste like soap. Well, soap probably should, but okay. It's called Thrills. It says it tastes like soap. It, it looks is. like something a geriatric would have to take five times a day. It literally says it tastes like soap. This also looks like um, gum. nicotine gum. Oh, yeah. I don't well, think I've seen gum served like that in a while. This looks like nicotine gum. So we're doing, we're doing an awful lot of reading. We're not doing an awful lot of chewing. 
There you Consider, go. Consider color me curious. Absolutely smells like soap. My mouth feels clean. You oh, know what? no, no. You know what? I can't even be mad because they told me. <laughs> Are you getting what I'm getting? Soap? Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting a slightly cinnamony taste. Do you know what it tastes like? Violets. I don't know what that is. It, it does taste like licorice. Oh, I love that. Is it licorice? Do you know? Things do not taste like soap. No. It's like uh, having a candy that says, no flavored like bleach. They didn't even like, it's, it, it's gum. Like throw a bit of mint in there and it might make it a bit better. It's not thrilling. Like, it's not like, it's not even giving me the thrill of like, oh, it's gonna, it's, it tastes like soap. I'm like, it doesn't taste like soap. Therefore, I'm not thrilled. <laughs> Nobody chooses to eat soap. If soap was a tasty flavor, then people would be eating soap. The longer I'm chewing it, the more I like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like an acquired taste. Yeah, you know, I don't really not like licorice. You. I don't love flair floral things. <laughs> no. No, I, I am no. so on board with this. I thought they were pretty thrilling all together. It's, a very, I, it's some of the weirdest stuff I've had in a while, like all together. Yeah, there was a variety there. We went back in time in Canada. Yeah, 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 absolutely. And what we found was nice. The good ones were so good and the bad ones were so bad. I like to think that it kind of met in the middle somewhere. Yeah, but the cherry bomb thing was lovely. Yeah, the cherry, I would, cherry yeah, blossom. Yeah, cherry blossom was probably that, my favorite. I think if you got cherry blossom a good Christmas advert, Honestly, yeah. millionaire. Yeah. Carl, there's a gap <laughs> in this it, market. Yeah. Come and fill it. Thank you so much for watching us try some Canadian snacks. If you want to see more snacks, trying snacks, uh, click the bell, subscribe, and we'll see you with new videos Monday, Wednesday, Monday. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. That's right. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Or Lundi, Vendredi, Mercredi, Vendredi. Vendredi, oui.